While searching for the witch Ciri had quarreled with, Geralt ran into an old friend, Kira Metz. The sorceress told the witcher about a masked mage. Ciri had seemed to taken shelter in his hideout. The witcher set off to find it, with Kira in tow. Ciri had never reached the elven mage, yet the wild hunt had. The ghostly retinue was one step ahead of Geralt, or so it seemed. The witcher felt that all was lost, until Kira gave him a new lead. The Crones of Crookback Bog. I'm listening. What do you come to me with? Okay, so hear me out. Your daughter is alive and well, but she actually hates you. Gave Tamara your gift. How'd she react? Probably not like you'd have wanted. She threw the doll away. Threw it away? Gods, I hoped, despite all. It's not that easy, Baron. <sighs>still don't know anything specific, but I'm on her trail. Well, will you stand there like a knob? Find her! So long. Lower of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to the channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me and hit that notification button as well. So, you know, when I upload my videos, you can also catch me on Twitch at loverlady 69 Looking for a hunter named Neelan. Found him. What do you want? Well, I saw your post, and I need to increase my XP, so you're just a side quest. Hear about your notice. I'm a witcher. When do you last see your wife? Oh, five days past, before dawn. On my way out to hunt, she were asleep. Come back. I have no sign of her. What? So she's been gone for five whole days, and now you want to ask for help? Dude, she could be dead at this point. Notice anything strange? Maybe her behavior? No, she were her happy, smiling self. Nothing different of late. She's not run off, if that's what you're asking. So why is she not here? Why is she gone? Like, why are you not actively looking for her still? Maybe she went to the neighboring village and forgot to tell you. No. My sister were never gone this long before. Tried looking for her? Asked around the village, none saw her go. She must have left when they were still sleeping. Told her time and again not to wander off on her own. She never listened. I must have some men folk to scour the woods. Okay, so I'll look for her because I bet with my witcher senses, I'll be able to find her easily. I'll look in the woods. You might have missed something. Ask around, too. She have any friends? Hannah kept, keeps to herself mostly, watches the blacksmith's youngins at times, and in the village, Glenna, the butcher's wife, she likes her best. Thanks. I'll try to find her, but no promises. Wow, five whole days, and now they're asking for help. It's like, I feel like they're not really trying hard to find a wife. Because if that was my girl, I would have been searching for her if she stopped talking to me within a couple hours, at the most. Okay, whatever. I'm just here because I need to talk to someone, and that someone is Glenna? Greetings, you Glenna. Aye, but gristle and marrow is all I'm willing to sell, and you'll have to wait till I'm done carving it. Yeah, about that. I'm not here to purchase goods. I actually want to... Well, you know what? You the butcher's wife? Butcher? Might have called him a butcher when we lived in the shade of Novigrad's walls. Now he deals in carrion, fallen animals, their bones still fit for soup. So, buying something? No, I actually have to ask you about Hannah. Wanted to talk to you about Hannah. 
hear you were friendly. She come by at times? We talk? She seems strange lately. Any idea where she might have gone? Hmm. Strange. No? A cheerful soul always. If I'm to judge, it's the wolves got her. They howl in the nights through lately. Even the Baron's men are feared to come by. Hannah must have gone to the wood to gather mushrooms, maybe. Straight too deep and the howlers got her. I mean, it makes sense. She's been missing for five days, so who knows? Maybe she actually did get killed, so... Thanks. Farewell. And if she did get killed, damn. I feel bad. But... Am I some sort of a unicorn? Why do people keep on commenting about my appearance? Hey, kids. Sir? Wow. My dad used to make swords like yours. Can I touch it? No. It's sharp. Better not. Need to talk to your father. I fought swords once. Now it's sides and o's. For good arms, you'll need to go to Novigrad. Sir, I have some questions about someone, actually. Wanted to ask you about Hannah. Heard she looked after your children. Aunt Hannah? Yes. Do you know where she is? No, that's why I'm here. She maybe tell you where she was going, or anything else? Mm. She said turnips are healthy, and we ought to eat them. I saw her go to the forest, with another lady. Mm -hmm. It was dawn almost. I'd gone out so I wouldn't wet the pallet. The forest? She's done for. Why? Really? A huge pack roams the area. None from the village dares go in the forest. Neelan's only one not afeared, but then he's a hunter. Wait, he's a hunter, but he has yet to find his own wife? Something suspicious is happening. Did you get a good look at the other woman? Know who it was? No. She walked in front of Aunt Hannah. I couldn't see. Interesting. Thanks. Farewell. Hannah w was with someone. And her husband's a hunter, but he can't find her? Something. Sorry, kid. I'm sorry. You were in my way. My bad. But, dude, something suspicious is going on. I really don't care about what the husband is saying. He, he put up a good act. I'm assuming he did. This can't be, though, like... Wait a minute, this is a house with a goat? Ah! Oh, princess. That is so hilarious. And your owner, he's here? I just want to say hi. White wolf. Wise wolf. What is it the wolf needs? Folk from the village come here often? Oh, when help they need, the pella they seek. Help with what? With the dead that come a-haunting. What? Peace must be made. But they must then wait for forefathers' eve. Or when an evil spirit runs wild in a homestead. Drive the spirit off the pella can. And if I needed, say, a love potion? Then to the witch you would be sent. Not a matter for the pella, that. That's so funny. I just want to say hi, so though. And thank you again for your help. It actually works, Beller. Okay. So, there's a hunter who can't find his wife. And she was not alone. You know, I'm not going to lie. Even though it's a game, I'm a little bit suspicious of walking through a graveyard. Sir, are you dead? You know what? I need to leave. There's already a dead body here. That's a bad omen. I'm good. I'm not. I'm minding my business. What's this? Thank you. Who was with the woman? It's obvious that the person that she was with must have been a familiar. She was comfortable enough to walk with this individual. So it has to be someone that she knows. Either a family member or a friend or possibly a lover who knows but clearly hannah was comfortable enough to be with that one person all right i see a couple wolves here let me 
Get ready, just in case, you know. Hannah! Hannah, where are you? These wolves, come on! Come on! Come on! Ooh, you got me! You got me! That is so cute! Witcher? Are you... Wait what a minute! You here? Shouldn't be in the forest alone. I yeah. I to tell you. You needn't look for Hannah. Why? She'd have returned long past were she alive. I'll pay you twice Neilan's pledge. Just tell the man his Hannah's dead. Don't what? You know what happened to her? I've no illusions, Witcher. In Velen, you're gone as long as she's been. You don't come back. Hannah's dead for certain. Neela ought to accept his loss. Move on with his life. You know, you're really suspicious. You're her own sister. And yet you're telling me... Actually, you're paying me to tell your brother-in-law to just say that she died? Why are you not searching for your sister? Why are you not crying, grieving, panicking, scared about what happens to your sister? Do you not care about her? Strange. People usually prefer to know the fate of their loved ones, whatever the cost. Exactly. What I'll not get my sister back. And Neelan's all I got left. Wait, I what? Lose him too. And, well, he'll not rest till he avenges his Hannah, even if it eats up his life. The man deserves better. Hmm, interesting. Sorry, not in the habit of leaving jobs undone. Folks speak true about you, witchers. You're heartless beasts. How am I heartless if I'm a. a <laughs> How am I heartless if the man wants me to find his wife? How does that make me heartless unless you're afraid? You're hiding something. And you don't want me to find out what it is that I'm about to find out. Alright, here's my theory. Number one. The sister has something to do with it. Number two, she probably, hear me out, this is my theory. She probably has the hots for her sister's man, so she kills the sister so she can try and get with him. How much you want to bet that's the case? Claw marks, deep. Huh. And look, we got an animal. Mm, no man did this. A beast. It's a beast. Hmm. Cuts. Made with long claws. Flesh torn clear off. Hmm. Clearly a beast this did getting this. Interesting. I mean, I get it. In the sister's defense, she said to herself, she's been gone so long, you might as well just give up and tell him that she's dead. Since there's a lot of beasts in the woods and she could have gotten attacked while she was just walking through. But if that's the case, then I'm expecting to see two bodies. Because earlier, the guy that I spoke to said that she was walking into the woods with someone. So if, she, if Hannah is really dead, then I'm expecting to stumble upon two bodies. So why, and that's another thing. People are trying to find Hannah, but were they aware that she was accompanied by someone else? Must be Spell Hannah. Her. Rotting corpse, torn to pieces all around. around. Oh, werewolf. no. No doubt about it. What? Be careful. A werewolf? Wait, there's a werewolf here? No, you gotta be kidding me. Blood and paw marks. Wonder where they lead. Dude, there's a werewolf ling lingering Shit. here. Climb the tree. I can't get up there. Maybe find something else on the ground. 
Like what, though? That's the thing. Okay, so if I'm dealing with werewolf tracks... Tuft of fur. Uh, whatever lost it hasn't bathed in a while. Oh, I see it. Okay, so at this point, it's a werewolf. A werewolf in the woods. And there's a good chance that Hannah must have gone attacked by this creature. And if that's the case, then... Mm, even though it's going to be sad news, the husband has to hear it nonetheless. Because I know for a fact he wants to know what happened to his wife. Oh, you hear that, you guys? Something sinister is happening in these neck of the woods. Question is... Man's clothes. Shredded, but no sign of blood. Who rips their own clothes off and leaves them in the woods? Wait, man's clothes? But didn't one of the witnesses say that they saw a woman who looked just like... Whoa! Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I have a good feeling. I have a good feeling. I see footprints, right? Or footfalls, whatever this is. Looks like a hunter's quarters. Oh, that's a bear. Okay, whatever. Let me... Alright, let me go inside here. What? So this is a house? There's a deer. Hmm. Lots of loot. Hell yeah. I'll take it. Thank you, thank you. Ooh, look at that. Silver. What is this? Obviously, there's more for me to pick. Who lives here? That's what I want to know. Wolf's liver. Oh, we got a clue. Let me, let me look through that treasure chest, though. Key required. Okay. Something important is in there. Notes. Under whose? I am who I am. I can't change that. Shirts woven of partisy and potions made of virgin's tears might work in old wives' tales, but not for me. It is come it is time to come to terms with it. With Hannah's love and iron discipline, I have found a way to manage. But I must remember to hide in the woods before the full moon rises. To go somewhere far from others, far from Hannah. The attack comes and then passes. I wake up with wounds in my hands and the taste of blood in my mouth. Perhaps it is for the best I don't remember. Killing prey with bow and arrow is one thing. To tear it apart with fang and claw. At least here, deep in the woods, I won't hurt any people. Merciful Melatili, watch over any who stray too close. And I don't even have a key for this. Here's the thing. I have a good feeling Hannah's sister is the werewolf. Hear me out as to why. Number one, she tried to pay me to stop the investigation. Number two, she tried to persuade me to tell the husband that she's dead, long gone and dead. Number three, based off of what the letter was written, clearly when that person was talking about Hannah's love, it has to have been the sister. And one of the witnesses did say that she saw someone who looked just like Hannah walk with her to the woods. So it's definitely Hannah that's the werewolf. Hold on. What's in here? Ooh. Hmm. 
Hmm. Blood's just barely dried. He was dragged here. Wonder where from. So something's in here. But I don't know where it is. Can I hold on. Blast? Yes. Alright, wish me luck. This is about to get crazy. You know, lots of stuff happens in the basement. Am I looking forward to it? No, I'm not. But just in case. I have fire damage already equipped. Wow, this is insane. I can't even see, barely. But I know, according to the map, I am going the right way. Oh! The wolves! A werewolf! Oh, snap. There's a werewolf. Bye. Woo! Okay, let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, this is bad. Okay, this is bad. Yes. Ooh. Okay, let's go. Come on. Oh, come on. Thank you. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Come here, big boy. All right. I need... Oh, I'm, I'm about to get turned up. Come on. All right. The wolf's down. All right, big boy. No! Stop! What? Him? You insane? Stand back. He's dangerous. Not to me, he's not. What do you mean? It's Nalan. What? Lycanthropy can afflict anyone, but it is a curse. So sorry, but I have to. You don't understand. I love him. He was near to being mine till you came along. Go away. Leave us be. To be yours? Not till I find out what's going on here. Spill it. I love now. Him. Always have. Even after I'd learned his secret. You... You knew? Did you know I shot myself in here to wait out me change? I knew. And I didn't mind. But you chose Hannah. Wow! I wanted her to see you. I wanted her to fear you. She'd not have stayed. And we could be together. What?! You brought her here. That night, it was the reason I had the taste of blood in me mouth come morn. I did it for us. She was to see you turn, not more. I didn't want her death. You've got to believe me. You're a sick woman. And I'll kill you willingly. First time for that, in fact. You won't kill anyone. Ever again. No! Don't hurt him! Get out of here before I change my mind. Run. Come on! It's a curse! There's no cure! He needs to be down. Next! Sorry I had to end this way. That is so insane. I mean, I could be a jerk and have her die, but... I would rather have her suffer. And live with the fact that not only did she lose a sister, but she lost her brother-in-law slash... Lover... Bleh. Some nerve. Some nerve. Dude, she is so sick and twisted for that. She was in love with the brother-in-law. And she purposely got her sister in danger. Hopefully, she'll get scared and run off. But she ended up having her sister killed instead. Mark Margaret? Yeah, that's right. Cry. Cry. You sick for that. 
You're sick for that. Live with the guilt. I'll take this. Thank you. How dare you, ma'am? How dare you get your own sister killed? You disgust me. You are so lucky I didn't have him kill you. Live with the guilt. If anything, I hope it eats you alive. The rats, why did he need them? Lady rodents? Better to have stuffed them with a poison or crushed them into a pulp with a shovel, but no. Did you see what he did with them? You know, I don't mean to be nosy, but I don't want to interrupt your conversation either, Kira, so... Wow. This is really Kira, interesting. What are you doing? Geralt. <laughs> you gave me quite a start. Sorry about that. But nay, the mage says bring me rats and healthy ones. Not something the cat dragged in. This the lamp from the elf's hideout? What's this about rats? Nothing important. I'll explain later. Now tell me, to what do I owe the pleasure? Mentioned you wanted something from me. I did, and still do. Mm hmm. The cursed isle on Lake Windama. You've heard of it, I'm sure. Yes, the I local have. Peasants mumble incessantly about it, about the wraiths that haunt it. They claim none who go there return. How did it come to be cursed? That's what I don't know. I must break this spell, yet I've been unable to identify its source. Gotta know something. Scraps. The curse is somehow linked to the tower where Serag, the lord of these lands, took refuge when Nilfgaard invaded. Claims in the village are that peasants, desperate of hunger, sailed to Fike Isle to beg for food. Met their end there. It was a massacre. So, will you please help me lift this curse? You're so good at these things. So the peasants who went to the island for food, this lord had them murdered? The villagers say he had them poisoned. That's horrible. Oh, That's gentlemen. dirty. Hmm. Well, I never met him. But he certainly didn't seem such a cruel man, judging by what a mage from the isle told me. A mage lived on the island? Did you know him? Where is he now? We were friends. Sadly, he died that day as well. I'm sorry for your loss. He survived. Yet even those who escaped the isle soon suffered agonizing deaths. Strangely, they did not seem to have been poisoned. So something sinister is happening. Why are you so intent on this? I'm not. The local peasantry is. The Isle, miss. You've got to lift the charm. You're a good witch, a great witch. There's no end to it. Uh-huh. See, I thought you didn't care for the locals. The great witch you are. Yeah, Kira. to lift the curse and they could conclude I'm not so great. Not enough to conceal me from the witch hunters and risk getting sent to the gallows themselves. What others think. Your image. That's all you care about. The point is, listen. I didn't flee to these wilds just to stupidly get caught because some bull with grit under his fingernails grows annoyed with me. Okay, I'm down. Alright, I'll help. I knew you'd find it irresistible. Naturally, you'll need to sail to Fy Kyle. Fine. What then? Well, the spirits who wander the Isle, you must establish a rapport with them. Don't know how, but they could point us in the direction of the curse's source. Think they'll be willing to chat? Of course, provided you take my magic lamp with you. I shall let you keep it afterwards in appreciation. Nice! I love useful, gifts. I'm sure. Thank you. Appreciate the gifts, Kira. So sweet. Can't you just come with me? I tried to go to Fikeyle once. Thought my head would burst, the curse's magic was so strong. Nice of you to send me there. I Doing your dirty work. I acute nasal hemorrhage. Oh. You stand to endure a wobble of your medallion at most. Ooh, at that's Aratusa, bad. they trained me to detect even the subtlest magic pulses. This was like getting smacked across my haunches with a grain flail. Funny. Thought you'd go in for that sort of thing. Take my boat. I left it on the lake shore near the village. Should be fit to use, provided rot hasn't eaten it, as it seems to eat everything here. Hopefully it works, the boat. How does the lamp actually work? I mean, do I just rub it, or do I have to do something, um, magical? <laughs> you needn't even rub. Just place it where you find bones and hear whispers. Um, 
I suppose I should warn you. It what what happened? Be the most pleasant experience. Mm, Figured as much. Tell no. you all about it later. Maybe skip the drastic bits. You'll need to do neither. I'll give you a Xenobox. It's a bauble that will let us speak over some distance. Nice, a phone. You will tell me what you see, and I shall tell you what to do and look for. Appreciate it, Kira. So, where'd you get the Xenovox? Found it in the mine along with the lamp. Thought it was part of the lamp at first. Didn't realize what I'd actually found until later. Think it belonged to the elven mage? Clearly. And I didn't even know the elves used them. Now we do. And honestly, great to have. It's convenient. Especially since I'm going to this by myself, doing your dirty work, Kira. Never heard of a Xenovox. It works just like a megascope, but is far more portable. Think of it as a magic box that talks. They hard to build? Extremely. That's why they're so rare. I certainly couldn't build anything like it. So no chance these Xenovoxes will catch on with every mage using one? Not the slightest. I need to know anything else before I go? No, that is all. Alright, I'll see you. Oh, I'm off. go already. I can't wait to see what you discover on Phi Kyle. Just be sure to come and see me afterwards. Okay. And Geralt. <clears throat> yeah. Thank you. Anytime. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.